Hi, welcome to my channel. I'm Ricardus, and today I'll tell you about the base of the Goldberg variations. I'm sure that you have already listened to the Goldberg variations of Johann Sebastian Bach. They are probably one of the most beautiful pieces have been ever composed. The Goldberg variations are an air with 30 variations. Each variation is realized with a different technique. Canons, fugue, alla breve, quadribet, dances, for one of or two keyboards. A great variety. Today I'll tell you about the bass. The air is composed of two refrained parts. We will focus on the first one. This is a picture of the bass line. The first part is divisible in other two parts. The first one is a very famous bass line in the 16th century. Many composers wrote their piece on it. It's the Ruggero bass. Now let's try to read it with a solmization. Because there is a sharp, let's transpose it a fifth down. Now we can sing it without any kind of alteration, namely in B duro, B hard, as old musicians used to say. Fa, mi, la, sol, mi, fa, sol, ut. If you are thinking that I'm reading these notes with a strange names, it's normal. I'm not reading with modern solfeggio, but as a musician of the 18th century, like Bach, with solmization. Let's try to solmize the second part of the Ruggero bass. Fa, mi, re, sol, mi, fa, sol, ut. In solmization, when the nature of the chant is beduro, we do mutation on D, E, and A. Doing mutation means passing from an hexachord to one other. We can see, except this La and this Re, which are interchangeable, that the two melodies have different notes, but the same syllable. Many composers used this artifice, like, for example, Girolamo Frescobaldi. This technique is called Redicta. It consists in re-saying the same thing, syllables, but in a different way, with other notes. Johann Sebastian Bach knew solmization very well. Indeed, solmization was still at the base of musical education in 18th century. Well, if you are interested on the musical didactic of the Renaissance and the Baroque, I invite you to stay tuned on this channel. So leave me your like, subscribe to my channel and click on the bell. Follow me on Instagram and Facebook and join my Telegram channel. I would be sincerely grateful to you if you want supporting me with a free donation. It would let me to realize original and high quality contents about early music. To stay updated on all videos and new contents, subscribe to the newsletter on the, my website ricarduscochlearius.com. All links are below in the description. Thanks for your visualization and see you in the next video. Bye!